that lost sons and daughters are coming home. Yes. We have expectation that bodies are getting healed today. Yes. We have expectation that the word is going to transform someone's life. And even in worship, God, let healing flow in this place. Yes. Yes. Uh, we trust you. We thank you. Hey, it's going to be a great day today, guys. Let's yes. believe for big things. All right, Jesus on three. One, two, three. Jesus! Jesus! Hey, uh, what we're going to do is we'll go one by one, and uh, we're going to celebrate each individual. It's obviously a big moment. We're so excited that you guys have joined in and uh, said yes to what God is going to do in the next few hours. Uh, I think a few things uh, before we even start is one, thank you. Two, I hope you're expecting God to move. to get a building for our church. And last week we, we got denied. We had a meeting and uh, we met with some people in this investment group that we already are working with. And they were kind of like, you know, you're a new church and it's just, it's just too soon. We can't tell the finances and all that. And, you know, we were like, okay, after church on Sunday, I get a text from the pastor and he says, uh, he says, uh, he says, I heard you guys got denied. He goes, we just got out of church. My pastor, the board, the people here at our church all got together after church and said, we have to do whatever it takes um, to get gospel at home. So today we're here to officially announce we got keys and a contract signed to a building. Y'all, this is for real happening. On Sunday last week, on Sunday last week, we got a text and I sat there and I looked at my wife and I said, I, th I think this might happen. like how we got into the building, what it was like. Um, but what was your like, what was your first thought when we got into the building? Um, for, uh, no more setup and teardown. Yes. Praise the Lord. <laughs> what was yours? Same. I think it was, I can't believe this quickly yeah. something like this has happened. Yeah, that was good. Because like when we moved here, we didn't, we're not connected to like a denomination or like a big, you know, organization that's established. Like we were building from the ground up. Mm -hmm. And so that family church would work with us. You know, we've heard yeah, about their church and what they're churches. about. Great people. So we start this whole like deal where we're like, okay, we're gonna get into the building. We had our sacred Sunday offering in oh. December. And many of you in our church, I remember talking about sacred Sunday and being like, well, what if we don't raise the full amount? Or like so much kind of, we were just saying, no, let's just ask God. Let's just believe he's gonna tell us what to give. And then we'll do whatever we need to do next. Right. And sure enough, man, people showed up. I mean, it was, it was incredible, um, the generosity of the people and really what took place. 
so yeah, so we got into the building, and I, think, I know we told the church that the plan was we would pay it off as the year went on. We raised a great mm -hmm. amount, um, and celebrating one year today, it only makes sense that we wouldn't just be telling you the building we're paying off, but we're actually out front of Family Church right now because we have the final payment already to pay off the building. Completely debt-free church. We're here today to go drop off the, right now we're gonna drop off to the board at Family Church, the final check for their building. And gospel second year, by the second year, we're already a debt-free church with a building paid off because of the faithfulness of God and the faithfulness of the people in Western New York. Come on y'all, won't you do it? Thank you for your generosity. Thank you for believing in the mission here. And like we've always said, God always provides. Amen. If it's his will, it's his bill. Amen. And so come on, let's go drop this off right now. Surprise. So